Doctor. Discovery at the point of terminal area energy management receiving navigation updates for the proper alignment and speed as it approaches the heading alignment cylinder in front of the runway. Discovery less than 70 miles from the landing site. Approaching the hack, no changes to winds or weather, nominal chute deploy. Five minutes until touchdown. Now the view from the pilot point of view camera, looking out of the heads up display. Looks like it's already on the straightaway path. Commander Mark Kelly now flying Discovery. Discovery goes subsonic on a Saturday morning, a Sunkiss shuttle announcing its arrival at the landing site. Three minutes, from hey. touchdown. Three minutes from touchdown. Commander Mark Kelly uh, handing the stick off to pilot Ken Ham, beginning an overhead left-hand turn to align with runway 15, the northwest to southeast approach to the three-mile-long landing strip. Discovery Houston on at the 180. Roger, on at the 180. Kelly now flying Discovery once again. Houston on at the 90. Roger, on at the 90. Houston, Discovery, runway's in sight. Discovery, now a line. 
Roger, runway in sight, Discovery. Discovery now aligned with runway 15. One minute until touchdown, Discovery perfectly aligned. Commander Mark Kelly flaring up Discovery's nose. Pilot Ken Ham to deploy the landing gear. Landing gear down and locked. Gear touchdown. Ham now deploying the drag chute. Nose gear touchdown. Discovery rolling out on runway 15 at the Kennedy Space Center, wrapping up a 5.7 million mile mission to further expand a global city in space. Garrett Reisman home after 95 days away from the planet. Discovery, beautiful landing, Mark, and uh, congratulations on a great mission. We will meet you on page 5-3 for post-landing. 